Three days after a deadly attack on the campus of Cal State Fullerton Police say they now have the man who did it in custody. The suspect reportedly the victim's co-worker. NBC Force Jonathan Gonzalez live in Huntington Beach where he spoke with some of the suspect's neighbors this afternoon. Jonathan. And Michael and Carolyn, that suspect is a father of two, married, has lived in this Huntington Beach neighborhood a long time, and his neighbors are just stunned to think that he is capable of what is really what was really a brutal crime. Take a look at a picture of the suspect. This is 51-year-old Chuyen Vo, also known as Chris Vo. Fullerton police announcing today at a news conference that Mr. Vo worked at Cal State Fullerton and was a co-worker of the victim, 57-year-old Stephen Chan. Chan was a longtime Cal State Fullerton employee who was found brutally stabbed to death in a parking lot on campus on Monday, the first day of the new school year. The suspect was seen running from the scene on camera around 8.30 Monday morning, and police believe that suspect is Mr. Vo. Last night, Fullerton police arrested Vo at his home here in Huntington Beach. Folks who live here on this street told me this afternoon they were stunned to see such a big police presence here, but could have never expected it would lead to the arrest of their neighbor in such a horrible crime. It's unbelievable to me because he was such a sweet, friendly man anytime I had anything to do with him, which was very seldom. That doesn't sound like him at all. No, not at all. I mean, what is he's like? very, very quiet. Um, he stays to himself. You know, the whole family, I mean, they stay themselves. Every time they see either my wife or I, they always speak, they always wave, they always say hello. It's, it's a shock. Now, it's unclear how long Vo has worked at Cal State Fullerton, but we did find one photo from about eight years ago in which he and other employees were being honored by the university. The victim, Stephen Chan, retired two years ago from the university as an administrator, but was recently rehired as a consultant, and police would not say today in what capacity Chan and Vo worked together or knew each other. We want to come back out live and tell you police would also not talk about a motive, simply saying that it's still under investigation at this time, and they would not say what led them to believe that Vo is the suspect, but they did find a backpack at the scene, and they say they found out immediately that that backpack belonged to Vo, who now faces a, a charge of first-degree murder. Reporting in Huntington Beach, I'm Jonathan Gonzalez. We'll send it back to you.